friends, Miss Janet here from the Stova Library for a story time. Just want to spend some time with you singing some songs and reading a story. So let's start. We're going to start with good morning, good morning, good morning to you. Good morning, good morning, good morning to you. How are you, how are you, and how do you do? Well, hello everybody and how are you, how are you, how are you? Hello everybody and how are you, how are you today? Hello everybody and clap your hands, clap your hands, clap your hands. Hello everybody and clap your hands, clap your hands today. And let's stomp our feet. Hello everybody and stomp your feet, stomp your feet, stomp your feet. Hello everybody and stomp your feet, stomp your feet today. How about we wave our arms? Hello everybody and wave your arms, wave your arms, wave your arms. Hello everybody and wave your arms, wave your arms today. Yay! Good to see you friends and I hope that you are ready to help me again. Let's do these are my glasses and this is my book. So get out your glasses. These are my glasses and this is my book. I put on my glasses and open up my book. Then I read, read, read and I look, look, look. I take off my glasses and close up my book. Good job. Okay, you've closed up your book and I'm gonna open up my book. I have two books I'm gonna read with you today. The first one is called Ray Bot and We Bot. And this is written by Adam Watkins. And it was, let's see here. It was published by Random House. Okay, so Ray Bot and Weebot. I don't know if you've heard this story before, but let's see what happens. Raybot has two best friends. So here he is with his friends. Just like you, you have best friends too. So Raybot has two best friends. He does everything with puppy and parrot. So here they are doing everything together. They play soccer and they go swimming. Those are fun things to do. They especially enjoy quiet days spent relaxing in the junkyard. Interesting. But this day isn't as quiet as others. And here is the dump truck. But dump He's just dropped off some junk. They all rush over to see who just arrived at the junkyard. Hmm, I wonder. It's Weebot. He's going beep. And here it says AFW Robotics. So here he is in this box. And it's Weebot. Raybot always wanted a little brother to play with. So here he is. He's going beep pop. And Weebot never, ever gets tired. Here he's going bop boop. He just keeps going and going. Hmm. Weebot always wants to play along. But you know what? He never knows when to stop. That could be a problem. Bop, bop. His paintbrush is still going. Uh-oh. Making a mess. Raybot tries to teach him the rules and how to play nice, but Weebot sometimes ruins things. He rarely powers down and he makes a lot of, of noise. Here he's going even when it's time to go to sleep. That could be a problem if something is just noisy, even at sleep time. Raybot wishes he could get away from the little robot. But, we, but Weebot follows him everywhere. Here he comes, beep, boop. He's following him everywhere. Raybot has a plan to make things like they were before Weebot arrived. Early the next morning, while Weebot is still asleep, Raybot puts him back into his crate. He's still snoring. Puts him back in his crate and he brings Weebot back to where he found him. So here he goes. He's going to leave him back where he found him. Raybot is excited to have a quiet day with just Parrot and Puppy. 
Oh, he's still sleeping over there. They're having, thinking they're going to have a great day. He tries to paint, but he can't find the inspiration. He tries to enjoy the quiet, but it doesn't feel right. Someone is missing. Raybot, Puppy, and Parrot rush through the junkyard to get Weebot back. Uh-oh, someone's driving away. Beep, beep. But they're too late. Uh-oh, Weebot's crate is empty. He's gone. Oh, dear. They head back to the junkyard. Raybot thought he would be happy without Weebot pestering him all the time, but he just feels sad. But wait, I hear Weebot, Weebop. Oh, Raybot can't believe his eyes, it's Weebot. Their friend has come home. Raybot has never been so happy. He's happy to get his new friend back. Even if Weebot still gets into trouble from time to time, and here on his table it he has a photo and it says, I love Raybot. So he loves his new friend. Wants to spend time with him. That's what we want to do with friends, isn't it? We want to spend lots of time together. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. I have another book. This one's called Hugs and Kisses for the Grouchy Ladybug. Uh-oh. Are you ever grouchy? And it's written by Eric Carl. And it was published by Harper Collins. So here we have Hugs and Kisses for the Grouchy Ladybug. It says, Hugs and Kisses will make you smile. Look at the smile on that crocodile. With all his sharp teeth, he's got a big smile. So they'll make you smile. Oh, and clap like Mr. Seal. Yay! They will make you jump for joy. Wow, just like that kangaroo. Yay! Jumping for joy. Make you stand tall like a giraffe. And swing from the treetops. Cool. You just might strut your stuff. Who knows what this is? Yes, it's a peacock. So they know how to strut their stuff. It might make you strut your stuff. Kick up your heels like this donkey. Yeah. Oh, or blush. Oh my goodness. And feel warm and fuzzy. So remember, just like you, even a grouchy ladybug needs hugs and kisses too. Hugs and kisses make the sunshine. That's awesome. Awesome. Okay, how about we stand up? Let's do Alice the camel and we'll start with five humps for Alice. So if you can stand up with me and we'll start with five. So Alice the camel has five humps. Alice the camel has five humps. Alice the camel has five humps. So go, Alice, go. Boom, boom, boom. Alice the camel has four humps. Alice the camel has four humps. Alice the camel has four humps. So go, Alice, go. Boom, boom, boom. Alice the camel has three humps. Alice the camel has three humps. Alice the camel has three humps. So go, Alice, go. Boom, boom, boom. Alice the camel has two humps. Alice the camel has two humps. Alice the camel has two humps. So go, Alice, go. Boom, boom, boom. Alice the camel has one hump. Alice the camel has one hump. Alice the camel has one hump. So go, Alice, go. Boom, boom, boom. Alice the camel has no humps. Alice the camel has no humps. Alice the camel has no humps because no Alice was a horse. Of course. Good job. Okay, let's do our thank you. My hands say thank you with a clap, clap, clap. My feet say thank you with a tap, tap, tap. Clap, clap, clap. Tap, tap, tap. Put your hands in the air. Turn yourselves around and bow and say thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
Nice to see you, friends. Have a great day, and I will see you soon. Bye for now.